In this episode, I will be showing you how to add TypeScript from your existing React application. If you are a software developer that started from a strongly typed programming languages such as Java and C Sharp, you might want to always have a type checking and see errors beforehand. Unlike without adding TypeScript, you only see the type errors after you've compiled and run the code. It serves as an early and preventive measure while you are developing your application. So here, I have an empty workspace. I will set up a React application using the create react app command. We can add TypeScript to this project by adding the following node packages. What this does is that you are installing the following packages. First one is the TypeScript package which installs the base TypeScript language. The next four installs the type definitions of the following node, react, react DOM, and the Jest testing framework. After installing, we can check out our current project and here you can see that the extension of the files are in .js. This will still work as expected, but if you want to leverage TypeScript, you will start replacing it with the .ts and .tsx extension. The .ts is a replacement for normal JavaScript files, while the .tsx is a replacement for files with React's JSX render components. As an example, we will be creating a custom component for the header. So we created the header.tsx file and then imported the React library. And then finally, we will be creating a sample header text. So if we will add this header component to the existing app component, we will do so by removing this boiler code here and replace it with a header component that we don't need. After adding the header component, we will be renaming the app component file to .tsx. Say for example, we need to add props to the header component. We can utilize TypeScript by adding an interface that we will be assigning to the props in order to give a proper object definition. We can add the interface named header props with a field of title which is a string. And then we can define the interface to the props like so. So when we try to open the app.tsx, we see that the header component is errored out. So when we add the title, TypeScript detects the title property is part of the object definition. And that's it. You can check out what TypeScript can do from its website, typescriptlang.org. And you can check out the Create React app documentation to know more.